Hey guys, it's Jake. And Liz. Have you ever thought of starting your own podcast? When we were first trying to get this podcast off the ground, we had a lot of questions. How do I record an episode? How do I get my show on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, and all the other places people like to listen to podcasts? How do I make money from the podcast? The answer to every single one of those questions is Anchor. Anchor is a one-stop shop recording, hosting, and distributing your podcast. Best of all, it's 100% free and ridiculously easy to use. And now Anchor can match you with great sponsors, too, so you can get paid for podcasting. So if you're interested in starting a podcast, go to anchor.fm slash start to join me and the rest of the podcasters already using Anchor. That's anchor.fm slash start. I can't wait to hear your podcast. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, this is Jackie Lance with the Hula Guns and Love Podcast, and this episode is sponsored by... Hello? 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 Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Hula Guns and Love on Facebook, Instagram, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and anywhere else you listen to a podcast. Anywhere else you listen to a podcast! Why are you yelling into the mic? I don't know, that's what I do. You sound like a crazy monster. Yeah, I kind of took my inspiration from the Sesame Street monsters. You've been watching who, Sesame Street? Who's the... I don't know. There's one of Cookie them. Cookie Monster? Uh, yeah, he's kind of Oscar. a yeller. Oscar? Yeah, he... No, oh, man. Definitely from Oscar. <laughs> definitely from Oscar. Why are you watching Sesame Street? No, I just... Once I started talking like that, I just kind of imitated my voice to that. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So, I got two stories to tell you. Okay. Well, one's just like I have something to say. The other is a story. One, uh, I just want you to know that I have a cold sore right now, and my lips... Okay, I have two cold sores right now, and my lips feel like I've snorted more cocaine than, you know, most addicts. Cause I'm Why all, does it I'm feel all like num- that? Because they that shit numbs my lips, and my... So it's like you just went to the dentist. Yeah, it's not good. Second of all... Today is the day. Today is the day. Let me tell you a story. So, I've been drinking coffee since the spring of 2006, and I swear if you interrupt me right now, I'm going to punch you in the face. Second. Okay? So, since the spring of 2006, I started drinking coffee. Okay? Let me tell you. First time I ever had coffee, like my own cup, I think I was drinking more creamer than coffee. <laughs> okay? So, like, this yeah. much coffee? <laughs> you might as well just ask me, do you want some coffee with your sugar and cream? <laughs> okay? Let's just say that as slowly as time has evolved, so have I. Okay? Shortly after that, I was mixing coffee and creamer, and, like, I, I thought I was going to reinvent the wheel. Okay? Short times after that, my creamer goes down. Okay, the time keeps going. The creamer just keeps going down. Today is the day when I officially like drinking black coffee. Okay, black coffee. Do you know how many years that is to where I had to grow up to drink black coffee? I'm sorry that I'm saying this in your face right now, but I can't help it. I'm so excited. That I just want to, like, go kick a door down. Like, I just want to burst into somebody's house right now and be like, BAM! I drink black coffee now! Okay? I thought you had to be, like, some kind of hard ass to drink black coffee. I didn't know it was just for anybody. Kind of excited. Okay? And you're not really saying a lot right now because I'm really excited that I can drink black coffee now and not want to throw my liver up because I'm so disgusted, but I'm really excited. You don't know what this is like. I don't have to go to the store no more and get the creamer to put in the coffee. I can just drink it black now. Nice, so you can save $7. Yeah, we can save $7 now because I don't got to drink the black coffee. Speaking of which, what if I want to add sugar cubes to my coffee? Where do you buy a sugar cube? Do they still sell those? Yes, why are you yelling? Because I'm really excited. Okay, we don't have to yell, okay? We're all adults here. Sorry about that. We're not like two-year-olds. Sorry about that. I'm just, you know, today I picked up a cup of black coffee. and So now your teeth are going to be brown. Well, browner, okay? 
let's let's all just embrace the fact that you came out an adult today. Yeah, <laughs> kind of. Okay, I can now stand around the water cooler and work with everybody, and just be like, yeah, I don't need that shit anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll I'll, I'll just drink it black like you. So you and Isaac. Yeah. Let's not bring up names here because they don't know Isaac. Okay. So let's not name drop. Okay. Let's not drop the mic. Okay. You didn't drop the mic. You just dropped your hand. Yeah, I know, but that was supposed to be a mic. Anyways, what are we talking about today? Well, I have a story. You have a story. Yeah. First time I had coffee. Story time with Lynn. <laughs> okay. No one else gets that joke because on like I don't know the 700th time we recorded this today. Liz made fun of me because I had a story, and she made fun of me. So now I'm just doing it back to her. But nobody else understands what I'm saying because we deleted that. Okay, Liz, tell your stupid story. It's my first time I had coffee. Okay, go. Um, it was. Okay, by the way, it's not a stupid story. I'm just. You know the story. I'm just. I was just a little bitter with you right there because you interrupted me, and I was in the middle of a great story about the first. Time I drank black coffee, which was today. I had black coffee before you did. You know what, Liz? Stop shoving <laughs> shit in my face. Okay? I'm sorry. Anyways. So, anyways. So, let's continue with your story. That is not stupid. No, it's a... So, my grandparents drink black coffee. Okay. Okay? So, when my... I'd sleep over at my grandparents' house... You know, their whole house would smell like coffee. Oh, I love that smell. I love that. It's like a warming smell now for me. Coffee in the mornings are lovely. Like, mm, it's great. <laughs> anyway, so one time I was sitting at the breakfast table with my grandpa. I think I was like very young. <laughs> I think I was like eight or nine. Okay. And I was like, hey, grandpa, can I taste your coffee? Because, you know, the smell of coffee doesn't taste like coffee. Yeah. Because I thought coffee that was going to be like, oh, this like warm, yummy smell. Because every child loves the taste of black coffee. Well, when... <laughs> One thing no child can resist. Well, when you grow up with the, like, my, my mom drank coffee, so my grandparents drank coffee. So it was like a smell that I, it's like I'm used to. Okay. So I tasted my grandma, my grandpa's coffee, and it was the most disgusting taste I have ever tasted in my whole entire life. I think I had to spit it up and have, like, maybe two glasses of milk to get that taste out of my mouth. Mm -hmm. So I, after that, I swore to myself I'd never have coffee because okay. it was nasty and disgusting. Okay. It wasn't my grandpa's fault. He didn't know that I was not going to like it. He was just, like, testing me out. Okay, so so you're so and then I met Jake, and he introduced me to a local company. Um, no name dropping. And okay, you can name drop. It's Beans and Brews. Okay. Um, which I love their Mr. B's. It's like the most delicious cup of coffee you could actually have. But it has a bunch of sugar in it, so I don't know if you really would call that coffee. Yeah. Anyways. And then Jake got me into coffee and hot chocolate mixed together, which is a good combination. Oh, it really is. So that's how I drink my coffee now, is half coffee and half hot chocolate. Yeah. With a tablespoon of creamer. I mean, you drink coffee like I used to. So call it what you want. Call it what you want. It on and maybe knuckle. be a wuss with coffee, but I still have coffee. Still have coffee. Just a lot of sugar and stuff in it. Yeah. Anyways, so I'm uh, I'm really happy that we I have evolved. More than I have. Yeah. It's I great. I think black coffee's nasty. I actually I'm, really enjoyed it. I'm surprised you drank it black. Yeah, me too. Me like, too. When Trust you me. showed me the cup, I was like, wow. Yeah. Cause see, I was I was walking around the room here and I was like, you're you're not this. And then I showed you my cup, and you're like <laughs> they, you dropping can't, your jaw. They can't see your. I know. That's why I had to say dropping the jaw. So, uh, what else is up? Nothing. nothing? We, uh, it's been a very stormy weekend here in Utah. So I wish every day just had gray clouds. You know what weather I want the you know what I want the weather to be like every day? Hmm. 
I want it to look like it does in the Batman cartoons. <laughs> That's really dark okay? clouds. Just whatever it looks like in those cartoons, if the weather could stay like that permanently, that would be amazing. Okay? I never want the sun to come out. Well, the sun kind of has to come out. That's how you get okay? your vitamin D if you don't take vitamins. Well, everybody, let's go buy some vitamin D. Okay? I just want as little sun as possible. I don't want it to rain all the time because, see, that's that's a huge inconvenience. It can rain if I'm inside the house. It snowed in the in the mountains. Yeah, I know. I saw that. It snowed in Sandy last night at, at the, the game. Yeah, at the game. Which I we weren't at. Our friend was. No name dropping. I'm not name dropping. I okay. Just a friend. All right. So what else is going on? It's the second that. time I've asked that. I know. What's going on with you? Uh, I really need more of the cold sore medicine on my lip. So it can so it can numb it? Yeah, so it can numb it and I can feel like I am, you know, just over here snorting. <laughs> just <laughs> I'm telling you, this hurts so bad. I don't understand how you got two cold sores at the same time. I don't know. I don't know if it's a cold sore or if it's a zit. Because I'm right now I'm really open at the zit. Could be the weather changed. It was 71 minute and then 50 degrees the next minute. I know. I know. I usually get a cold. I'm surprised I haven't gotten a cold yet. Yeah, me too. It sucks. Mm -hmm. I hate this. Mm -hmm. Okay? It's not fun. It sucks. It just sucks. Yeah. It's no fun. I have, I don't want a cold sore. I hate cold sores. Yeah, I know. I can't even share a glass of water with you. Or kiss me. Or that. What are we talking about today? Um, I was thinking we could talk about household products. What do you mean? Household appliances. Okay. Okay. Maybe you should. Uh, the, I, the, I guess I guess you could qualify this as a a complaint, a Jake's complaint. Yeah. Okay. Because I don't have any problems with the household appliances. That no, we have. you don't. Because you're always the one operating them. Okay? Me, I'm always the one sitting on the couch. And then all of a sudden, I just hear household products going off while I'm watching TV. And it's really freaking annoying. Okay? So let me, let me demonstrate what I'm going through. Okay. Okay? I am sitting on the couch watching TV. Okay? Doesn't matter what it is. What time in the morning? It would probably be five. Okay. Well, they don't know. Well, yeah. Yeah. So it's, but let's just go with this one. It's five in the morning. Okay. And we drink a protein chick every day because it's easy and it's quick. Okay. So we do our protein shakes in the ninja. <laughs> Every single day, I'm watching something on TV, and all of a sudden, you hear, ah! Okay? And then, it, and then, hold on, and then it stops. Okay? There's no, like, pause, or, hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn on the tank. Don't mind me. No, and then it pauses for a second, and then you hear, ah! <laughs> and it's like it's like a war machine just rolled through our house. <laughs> okay. So that's kind of annoying. It's not that loud. Let, 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 let's skip ahead. No. We let's need to skip. explain why I have to do it in the ninja, okay? I could shake it, no problem. Yeah. But no, 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 no. The reason why I have to do it in the ninja because Jake has to have his protein drinks cold with a banana in it. Okay, it tastes good with a banana in it. <laughs> okay, but you're complaining about something that you cause. Okay, but you do it too. Because I like mine cold, but I don't have to have it cold. I can just shake it. I'm not saying. That you don't have to do it. All I'm asking for is for you to go, hey, I'm going to make protein <laughs> shakes now. Instead, I just get that. 
Ah! It's not even that loud. Okay, so let's 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 jump back about an hour. Okay, let's skip ahead to four o'clock. To no, four. we're going back. Oh yeah, we're not let's skipping. So, we're rewinding. Okay, so let's rewind an hour that day. Okay. Okay, so you blow dry your hair most mornings. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> And so the whole time we've had our house, there's been this plug yeah. in our bathroom. And that plug hasn't worked. No, we couldn't figure out why. Yeah. Because it was on a – I can't remember what that freaking switch is called. What's that stupid switch called? Um, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I can't remember. So anyways, you've always gone – out there in the and, blow, other bathroom. and blow dry your hair. In the okay? other bathroom. Okay. So you've always done that. Sure. I've always came in here, got dressed, bam, boom, laid on the bed, waited until five to eat. Okay. That's a story for another day. We won't go there right now. So recently, we've got our plug fixed. Because you fixed it. We figured out what was wrong. Yeah, with we it. figured right. it out. And so, anyway. We figured that problem out, and then one day, you're like, "Hey, I don't need to. I don't need to go leave the room anymore <laughs> to blow dry my hair." Sweet. Well, because you know, I don't want to wake uh, anybody else up in the house. Okay. Okay. Can I, can and, I, and I'm like, okay, it's my room too. I can. Can I finish the story? I just stick it up for myself. I'm. I, I'm not saying that you shouldn't be able to. It's just if you want me to stay in here, I <laughs> okay. I'll have to leave. Okay. So, anyways, we have this fan in our room, and Liz blow dries her hair in front of the fan. <laughs> that fan just so happens to be blowing on me. Okay. <laughs> and blow dryers and. Wet hair make, I don't know, tropical weather. So I'm sitting there on the bed, frying to death in tropical weather, okay? It's more humid in here than Florida. <clears throat> so the next day you came into the room and you started to blow dry your hair, and I was like, mm, none of that shit in here. Go to the other room. I'm sorry. You're going to roast me. <laughs> One of us is going to have to leave the room right now. It's either you or me. But you know what? With the new addition to the house, no name dropping, okay? It might just start being me. Being your what? That's going to leave the room. So you... Oh. Yeah. Yeah. What? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Because you're going to go enjoy what? The living room. Because? No name dropping right now, Liz. Okay. Sorry. <sighs> so let's skip ahead a few days. A few days? Yeah, just shut up and listen to me. Okay. Let's skip ahead a few days. So we either clean the house, like a deep clean. Yeah. We deep clean our house. Uh-huh. On, sa- on sa- Friday night. Friday night. Or Saturday morning. Yeah. Again, watching TV, not knowing. <laughs> I should know because the hall closet is right where the vacuum is. But sometimes I'm just not paying attention. You know, I'm watching weird history facts on the YouTube, and I don't know. I don't see you going after the vacuum. Okay? You go after the vacuum like a freaking terrorist. I like our house clean. I agree with you, but you can, I'm just saying, let me know. And then all of a sudden, they're talking something about Hitler and I don't know where he kept the freaking Jews. And then all of a sudden, it's... Okay. Like, I wasn't watching something. Okay, one. Our... Ah! We 
in your new vacuum if it sounds like that. Okay. <laughs> the vacuum <laughs> sounds like tears of children. <laughs> it's terrible. I hate it. All I'm saying is, is just be like, hey, Jake, I'm going to turn the vacuum on. Okay. Or, hey, Jake, could you back in the floor? I'd be cool with that because then at least I know that it's coming. I, I was, it's like going to the dentist and not knowing you're going to get your teeth pulled. Okay, but I want the vacuum done at that moment, not whenever it's convenient for you. Okay, I'm just saying. I could help. But at least I know it's coming. I know, so I can, the other thing that makes you pissed off, too. See, I can't think of what you're about to say right now because I thought of the three household products that I hate the most, which are... The Ninja blender, mm -hmm. the hair dryer, mm -hmm. tropical weather, mm -hmm. and then the vacuum, Tornado City. I can think of two others. Well, one other, because the other one you really can't. So our oh our here, house, hold on, hold on, I'm, hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm oh, a lot. I just want to say one more thing. So we have a Ninja, mm -hmm. a, a shark vacuum that you know vacuums the floor. Yeah. Why don't you just use that instead of turning? Because you used turning... to turn it on in the morning and you don't do it anymore. No, I know, but why don't... I don't know. So while you're cleaning, why don't you just use that? Okay. Okay. So anyways. And then neither one of us has to be inconvenient. Our house is one level. We don't have a downstairs. We don't have an we don't upstairs. Have stairs, so it's one level. So everything is on one level. Our kitchen and our laundry room is in the same area. When I'm doing laundry, oh gosh, <laughs> Jake hates it when I have the washer going because you can hear the water when it's spinning and we have and the, the, dryer. the dryer's signal thing goes off. Uh -huh. So he hates it when I do laundry as well. You know, I just don't like loud inconveniences. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure I hate that. What else? Um, the sink. I hate the freaking sink. Oh, when I clean the <laughs> the kitchen, I like to. This is just how I clean. The water just runs. <laughs> I hate that. <laughs> I hate that so much because when I do the dishes, I turn the water off because I hate hearing. <laughs> yeah, but I'm wiping. It's freaking annoying. <laughs> I'm wiping it down the the the. Counters. It's so annoying. I'm wiping so down the annoying. counters, and I don't want to have to go back and turn it on and off, on and off, on and off. Like, do you just realize, let it go. Do you realize how easy our sink is to turn on and off? It doesn't matter. It's so easy. I hate it. <laughs> so here's a confession of of annoyed of, of an annoyed person. Stop leaving the faucet on. That's not gonna happen. Gee. <laughs> <laughs> That's just how I am. Okay. Just like you're you you are how you are. Okay. What other one did you have? That's all. Oh, okay. So just the uh, dryer and the vacuum. No, the washer. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, sorry. You sorry. brought up the vacuum. I know. I'm sorry. Tornado Valley or something like that. You oh, you know what? You know what else makes me mad? That the household product, but it has nothing to do with you. It's just that we need it. What? I hate watching TV with the fan on. What fan? Oh, in our room? Yeah. It's freaking annoying. Because you can't hear anything? <laughs> can't hear anything with that on. It's so stupidly annoying. So I'm just happy that we don't have to get out of bed anymore to turn the fan on. Because let me tell you, turning that, uh, getting out of bed, to turn your stupid fan on is horrible. Yeah. It's horrible. That was one of the worst things ever. Mm -hmm. Okay. Fortunately enough, we discovered how to uh, turn that on with the Google. Uh -huh. And yeah, that's amazing. Okay. Awesome. It's amazing. I like it. It needs cleaning. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Now we just got to figure out how to turn it on all of our lamps. You gotta like pee. My back hurts. Oh, so this uh, bench isn't too good for your back. Do you like want to stop this and come back to it? No, I'm good. You you can like go walk around. No, I'm good. You know you can go turn on uh, one of your annoying household products. <laughs> I don't have to do that until tomorrow. 
Oh, because of the ninja? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, uh, what else do you want to talk about for six minutes? What else you got? Why don't you tell them about our new addition? Our new addition to the house? Yes. We got a new couch. Yeah. We've never had a new couch. Never. Ever. Ever. Okay? Normally, we're the type of people who just drive down the street, pick up the best-looking couch on the side of the road, bring it home. Hopefully, it has some bed bugs in it. And that's uh, that's how we roll. Or we make our own couches. Or we go buy one from the thrift store. Okay? Hopefully, one that has 10,000 farts to it, at least. <laughs> If the farts aren't high, we don't bring that thing home. Yeah. Okay? So but it's a very comfortable couch. Yeah, yeah. Jake we, hasn't gotten off it at, at all this weekend. Yeah, it's Just true. Just go to bed. We, let, me, let me tell you. We've gotten a new couch, a new bed, a new memory foam bed. Mm -hmm. Man. We're like... <laughs> moving up in the world yeah i know it's yeah. awesome isn't it yeah it's great it is wow what else have we got that two uh that two we... new tvs wow wow okay by the way we're not bragging no it's just never <laughs> we just save up our money and then we buy it out straight out yeah we don't like we don't want, we don't credit stuff. card we don't credit card we don't we don't cc Wow, this is slowly the back. Oh. The back end is kind of getting out of whack. The back end. <laughs> I wondered what the hell you were talking about. The back end. I was like, what? What back end? Anyways. So, yeah. Now with the new couch, we're gonna build a new table, and this podcast. Geez, why the hell would you even listen to this right now? Just stop. <laughs> Do you have like any YouTube recommendations you want to? Uh... Um, that was that weird history. Yeah. Is interesting. Yeah. It's kind of. I don't think I would live back in the days before now. You mean back before? I don't want to live any time before modern cell phones. Yeah. Yeah. No thanks. It was kind of like you listen to that stuff. It may it's weird, but it's like I couldn't survive that. I don't think. Or here's another good one. I don't want to live any time before modern toilets. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 I'll, I'll just not. Yeah. But that's an interesting YouTube channel. Um, I like the handyman. The handyman? Mm -hmm. Who goes around and fix shit? Mm -hmm. Anything else? You've uh, never recommended this many the things. The one guy that we were watching last night that made the vice. Uh huh. What's his, what's his YouTube? Pace makes. There you go. Pace makes is yeah. he's good. Yeah, I like woodworking stuff. I'm I know it's not like a, you know, I also like you know cooking channels, but you know who are work. your cooking channels? Um, Laura in the kitchen. Laura in the kitchen. Um, Jenna, cupcake Jenna, Gemma. Uh, she still puts out videos. Mm -hmm. hmm. Um, those are the ones I basically watch. What about Anna Olsen? I like her. Every night before you go to bed, you're watching one of her videos. <laughs> what about you? Um, I just watch whatever's interesting. You were like had an obsession with like, um, unbox therapy for like a week and a half. Yeah. And then, um, what the heck's that guy's name that we watched? Matthias. Matthias. Really? Jason doesn't like Matthias. He says he's boring. You know? I think he's interesting. I think he's a very smart person. Yeah, he's too smart. Yeah. Okay? All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for listening to this episode of the podcast. Please like, share, and, and subscribe, subscribe to any of our platforms. Okay? We didn't mean to say that at once like we're freaking twins, but that's just the way that it went down. Okay? I will uh, see, we'll see you next Sunday. Uh, we're really sorry that this podcast is so unperfect and so unedited and so raw. But you know what? That's just how we do things over here. And Liz, do you have anything else you want to say to the people? Come back next week. Come back next week and like, share, and subscribe. Thank you very much. Bye. Bye.